I'm going to show you how to make the Zen Tangle called Jetties. And with Jetties, you start with um, a large circle, or if you're talking about Zen Tangles, they call it an orb. Okay, so you're going to make a series of these touching each other. And they're going to become all different sizes. And it's probably more interesting if you do make them different sizes and if you let them go out of your square. See right here I could put a small one, maybe a little guy right there. Okay, so you want to fill up your square with orbs. it's okay if they're not perfect circles. You don't need to get a template out or anything like that. You want them to look like they have some life. They were drawn by a human, not by a machine. Okay, so I have all of my orbs drawn. Now the next thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make like an arch or a curved line going across the orb. I'm going to make another one that's running parallel right next to it. That one is going to be shaded in black. Now on either side of that line I'm going to make another one and another one. So they're all parallel to each other. And I think it's really interesting if when you curve your lines, you curve them going in different directions. This kind of reminds me of like when you go to the dentist and at the end you get like a toy and a machine and all these little things are, little um, balls are stacked together in there. That's kind of what it reminds me of, like a vending machine. Don't forget to turn your page, too, if it helps you to draw things a little bit better. I'll even get this little guy. Okay, and I would continue doing this, filling up all of the orbs with these lines. Now if I have one that is too small, like this little one right here, he might be too small to put three lines on, so maybe I'll just do one line. And that's okay too. And this is the tangle called Jetties.